This is an opportunity for CMC to not only come together, but share its story with the world. What makes me excited about participating in the Rose Parade is that it's such a big community event with a lot of history. The Rose Parade has been a very long-standing tradition in California's history. It's just nice to be recognized and be involved in something that is just so important to our community. Growing up in Southern California, the Rose Parade was such a big deal. I mean, these floats were larger than life. I think it's really neat to be able to share on a world stage what CMC is and what it really does to shape the leaders of tomorrow. This is a huge deal for CMC. I know personally in my previous job, I worked internationally and everybody who I talked to watched the Rose Parade. It's got a worldwide audience. It's in the multiple, multiple hundreds of millions. We have so much to be proud of this year. And so this is a wonderful stage and a wonderful opportunity to get our message out of how great things are going at Claremont McKenna College. We'll have 12 CMC students representing athletics, ASCMC student government, our different institutes and centers, our different scholar communities. We'll have a mini CMC riding that float in so many ways. I'm excited to represent CMC at the Rose Parade, especially because CMC has developed me into the person I am today. I'm really looking forward to representing CMC at the Rose Parade because CMC and the CMC community has become an increasingly important part of my life. CMC does a really great job of making sure every student feels like they belong. I'm really excited to be representing CMC as a Questbridge Scholar because I think our personal backgrounds it should never hold us back. CMC really is small enough to know you, large enough to serve you. And at no other school do you get this kind of rich resource and opportunity and these kinds of people to share your four years with. What makes Claremont McKenna unique in the world of higher education? Come and learn from our beautiful float that's 55 feet long and 26 feet tall. I was blown away by the design of the CMC float. I think it's incredible. And I think it's gonna look so amazing and beautiful once it's all decorated and covered with flowers. A snow-covered Mount Baldy is really that iconic view of Claremont McKenna College that I remember when I first stepped foot on campus. Our three iconic buildings, Robert Day Sciences Center, Kravis Center, and Roberts Pavilion. A take on our Book and Globe logo with a row of books surrounding a spinning globe showing our commitment to world affairs. And three of our usual public art pieces. It's an accurate reflection of some of the things we love to see here on campus. From Robert's Pavilion to the various pieces of artwork around campus, it's all the things that you associate with the CMC name. We have 75 rich years of history of creating leaders for the future. We have the perfect platform to leverage our past and turn the corner to our future and really embrace our role in taking on some of the biggest problems facing society. Since not a single operational dollar is being used from the college for these activities, if it wasn't for our 26 donors to step up and say, this is important to me and for CMC to be on the stage uh, in front of 100 million people, we wouldn't be here. All of the events that they've put together have really been first class to get not only the students to get engaged, but also people like me who are alumni. Who doesn't love this parade and just seeing the momentum that it's created? And I think it's a really unique experience for CMC. I hope that our community comes together and looks at this amazing opportunity that we had to share our story with the world and looks back fondly on the opportunities to engage with our community and most importantly the excitement of knowing that 100 million people just learned a little bit more about Claremont McKenna College.